What's going on everybody? Scott from Grassroots NASCAR Racing here. Uh, so a little while back, I don't know if you saw it on my Facebook page, I posted up some pictures of a really cool old toy hauler. It was a, like, a, I think it was a 1946 if I remember correctly, like bus, city bus or something that had been converted to a toy hauler. I put up some pictures and man, it just, it kind of went viral. People wanted to see a walk around video and stuff of it. So today, there she is. I'm here back at the bus. Uh, gonna do a walk around video of it and we'll peek inside, take a look. But I just wanted to show it to you guys. This thing is so cool. I love the looks of it. That 40s style is just so awesome. And then to convert it into a toy hauler, it's just incredible. So let's walk around and take a look at it. So here she is in all her glory. Very cool. Like I said, that 40s style. Like look at those lights up top. That is just awesome. You got the turn signal lights that actually have an arrow. Look at that. That's cool. I guess that says B-Line. B-E-E-L-I-N-E. -E -E. Yeah, it looks like it. Needs a little work down there. But I wonder how hard it is to get new. That's not even glass. Yeah, not with all that. So you could probably make that pretty easy. Wouldn't be too bad. Let's go back to the business end. That is so cool. Now the owner of this, his name is Tom. He gave me permission to do this video. He actually built this uh, by himself back in the 70s. He was doing some racing and needed something to haul his race car. So he built this whole thing. Really cool. Look up here. I didn't even notice those lights. <laughs> I love how he kept the back end like that. See those lights up underneath there? Those are so awesome. So it looks like I, yeah, he's got a winch down there. Got the cherry picker on the side. See it on the side there. I wonder if the ramps are still in here. Yeah, there's some ramps up in there. Got rollers. Oh, boy. Yeah, gonna have to do something about the rollers. <laughs> nope, that one's stuck. Not even gonna try that one. Let's get up here a little bit so we can see this. Look at that. That is so awesome. See if this one opens. <laughs> Everything is rusted shut. These hinges are like rusted shut. Looks like there's maybe some ramps and things down inside there. But look at this. Look at the way he built this. It's a ramp and then you got the, the ladder just going straight up to the top platform. That is so cool. Put something up here. I don't know what he would have put up there. Let's peek in this back window. We're gonna go inside here in a minute, but let's peek in. It'd be nice to have something covering this so water doesn't get in here, but you can see the water's eating away. Pretty good at that back part there. It's got a toolbox. There's a valve cover sitting on the workbench still. Wow. That's crazy. All right, let's back up and head back down here. Been sitting here for a while. You can see these trees have actually grown out to get some sunlight. So it's been sitting for a while. I asked him though, I, man, believe me, I asked him, I want this. I asked him if it's for sale. No, he said he's going to keep it. He's going to restore it. He's got a shop just right, ne ne right next to this place. So he wants to restore it and get it back up and running again. So, hey, as long as it's being restored, that's cool. That's all that matters. I just don't want to see it rust away and, you know, turn to trash. So, <clears throat> well, like I said, there's your cherry picker. Man, that just looks so cool. I love the curves of that. 
cool that this piece right here was kept too. Like he did it right at this level and then kept this piece going across. That looks really cool. It's all metal. It's so neat. He said it's got a Cummins in it. I'm not sure exactly what engine is in it, but. It's down here. Ah, batteries. There's oil. <laughs> oil. All right, here's the door. Let's see if we can get in here. He said I could go ahead and just move this and walk on in if I could. Got a tree right in the way, but... Oh yeah, look at that. That is so cool. Got a first aid right when you walk in. I hope there's no like wasp nest in here. That's really gonna suck. You got a door. Some panels, I'm not sure where those all go, but that's good that he has all this stuff still. Those are, I'm sure this stuff is impossible to find. Yeah, that looks like that probably goes up front. Maybe down lower down there. Hmm, I don't know what that is. Interesting. Looks like almost like it's some kind of generator or something. Like a fresh air intake or something, and I'm not sure. Here's the driver's seat. You got a radio behind you. Interesting. Citizen band transceiver. Ooh, spider webs. Gross. That is awesome. It reminds me of like a old, old airplane or something. Like all your, so many controls are over here on the side. What is that? Head, tail. So those are your lights. Four-way flasher, spotlight. More of the lights. Fan. Air con hey, air conditioning. Maybe that's the air conditioning. Maybe that's what this big thing is back here. Some kind of giant AC system from the 40s. What is that? Reverse shift to one. Press the reverse button. Hmm. So one, two, three, four, neutral, and reverse. So it's only a four speed. Door controls at one point. There's your air. Mile per hour. Wow, that is crazy. Front brake control. Slippery and normal. <laughs> so you can adjust the brakes based on weather conditions, I guess. There's another radio that somebody put in. Wow. And then you can fit two people over here on this side. Oh boy. You gotta watch out for this stuff. Pick this up. There we go. Alright. No stinging bugs yet, so we're good there. Let's go in the back. That door opens up. There's his tools nice wood cabinets I'm sure he probably made all these cabinets is there parts still in here yeah, a little bit some polish AC spray paint <laughs> that's crazy I think that was a bed maybe It'd be nice. Man, if this thing was fixed up, it'd be so awesome. <laughs> well, there were some stinging bugs in here. A lot of them. It seemed built up all over. 
Ah, there you go. You can hang your fire suits. What is this? Custom race cars. Nice. That's cool. Got some welding stuff. <laughs> Thunder snaps. They were doing some fireworks at some point. Ooh, a dual tape deck. How sweet is that? Oh, man, he's got his equalizer like way off. Come on. <laughs> That's awesome. Old hat and shoes. Some sunglasses. This thing is cool, man. Got some speakers. Irish spring. Some band-aids. Teepee. Can't forget that. <laughs> wow, this is so cool. Oh, and look at that. Got his stopwatch for the races. How neat. I don't know what's down here. I don't want to open this up. Well, actually, can I pull this open? Let's see. Oh, this one's... That one's shut. No. Yeah, I don't want to force it. We'll leave it as it is. All right. Well, man, this thing is cool. What do you guys think? How cool would it be to have this thing be redone, be back on the road, nice and freshened up? I think this would be just incredible to see. So hopefully he gets it up and running. It's like, what is this? Oh, that's, that's your AC. Low cool, high cool, low fan, high fan, cooler. So yeah, this must be the AC unit back here. All that. Let's see what this is. Oh, oh. Nope, doesn't want to open. <laughs> All right, well, let's get out of here. It's already getting hot, man. It's too early in the year to get hot. I don't like that. I don't want the heat this early. Whoa. Close. <laughs> there we go. All right, let's go back outside. Ooh. All right. I'll put the board back on that later, but these windows look pretty good over here. Behind the tree. The front end looks pretty good. Jeez, oh, wheels polished pretty nice. Man, that thing's cool. I so wish he'd sell it. That'd be so awesome to have. Throw one of my stock cars on the back of this thing. Man, that'd be fun. Smart guy though. I mean, just the engineering to create this thing. Very cool. Like I said, I think it's a 1946 bus. So. Man, so yeah, hopefully he fixes it up, gets it back and running. Maybe one day we'll see this thing driving down the road. How cool would that be? Awesome. Well, thanks guys, thanks for checking it out with me. That was fun to explore inside there. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, man, ah, I so wish I could buy that thing from him. Dang it, but. I'm glad he's going to restore it. So anyway, guys, that's it for me. I got to get out of here. So take care. Bye. Okay. I said I was done, but I'm not because I was walking out here and I noticed he's got two older buses back here in the back. How cool would it be to convert those? They're not in as good a shape, but look at that thing. Probably from around the same time period, maybe 50s on that one. That one says Hope. Baptist Church it looks like that one looks like it's more together though man yeah that's cool uh, so many cool toys so many cool projects out in the world you just never know but I don't know I can't I don't have time for any more so that's it I'm out of here bye